Kathy Kaiser. I'm a user experience professional, and I love my job. I don't just view it as a job, I view it as a mission, which when you think about it, is a little creepy. It made me think maybe user experience is a cult. Have you ever said things like, oh, he gets it, he's one of us, or hey, they finally drank the Kool-Aid. We think about UX in terms of a conversion experience. They've seen the light, hooray, hallelujah. But what is a cult anyway? Um, there is a negative connotation to the word, but all it really means is a group with intense interest in and devotion to a person, idea, or activity. So as you can see, there can be many, many subjects for cults. Are cults inherently evil or dangerous? Well, some certainly have been dangerous for the people who have been involved in them. Uh, but academic research has argued that places like AA could be cult-like. They have cult characteristics. We're not sure yet about Apple, <laughs> if that's a good cult or a bad cult. Mark Lanter at NYC Medical Center has um, identified four characteristics of cults. Cults have a shared belief system, they are socially cohesive, they have uh, behavioral norms, and they follow charismatic leaders. So let's see if UX uh, fits this definition of a cult. Do we have a shared belief system? Of course we do. You know and love our beliefs. There are no stupid users, only bad designs. You are not your user. These are the mantras that we adopt and share when we go out into the world. This is what we preach. Are we socially cohesive? There are so many UX events that I wonder how we get any work done. <laughs> uh, never, never mind all the activity on places like Twitter and, and LinkedIn. We have a propensity, a desire to share war stories and learn from each other. Do we have behavioral norms? Absolutely. In fact, the key struggle of user experience is making sure it's actually practiced and not just paid lip service. So our norms are very important. And then finally, do we ascribe divine power to our leaders? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I didn't even have to make that picture, by the way. <laughs> experience a cult? Yeah, I think so. We are a close-knit community, we have strong beliefs and practices, and we have a healthy dose of hero worship. So here we are, welcome to the cult of UX. But what does this mean for us? Why do we care? Well, if we think of ourselves as a cult, we can use that as a framework for identifying ways that we can improve and be more successful in our work. So what lessons can we learn from the cult perspective? Well, first off, every cult needs Converts. Okay? We need to go out and preach the gospel and bring new people into our field. We need to continue to spread the message. But we need to do it in a way that maintains the integrity of that message. So how do we do that? Well, it's all about supporting our academic programs and becoming mentors. Anyone can be a user experience professional. But they have to learn how. So that's our job. We have to make sure we're sharing that knowledge and sharing our beliefs so that we can maintain a strong field. And part of that is codifying our best practices. We may not agree on everything. We have different methods, different ways of doing things. But we have to make sure that we are continually refining those and having the conversation. So to do that, it's all about debate. Okay? We need to come together at places like EPA and kick the tires of each other's approaches and really understand what works and what doesn't and not accept things that don't make the cut. We have to test our methods early and often to make sure they're delivering for us. And then finally, we have to infiltrate, but not alienate. We may be a cult, but we're not off in a compound somewhere. We're out there in the business world. And if people are going to include us as their, on their teams, we have to be friendly and positive and, and add value in an effective way. No one wants to work for this guy, right, or with this guy. Okay? It's very important, you know, a lot of our UX uh, professionals tend to think that we know the answer. We know the right way. The user is most important. But it's just not that simple. We have a voice, but if we're yelling all the time, it won't be heard. So we need to be a team player. We have to love our users, but we have to love the business too. Business goals are just as important as user goals. That's not blasphemy. So we have to pick our, our battles and fight gracefully. So here we are. We play well with others. We go out into the world and preach. And then we come back to our cult for support and refinement and to make things better for ourselves. So I would say, yes, we are a cult. It's a cult I'm happy to be part of, and I hope people continue to drink the Kool-Aid. Thanks. <laughs>